wants to walk with Elias? Right now, absolutely nobody, cause Ezekiel is here and he's running wild. We want to hear Zeke speak, damn it! Some of us can say it's a total miracle. Elias' character was pretty legit, catchy catchphrase, dope beard, a freaking guitar, classic heel, definitely wrestler with a soul. But all the drama that is happening right now with the Elias' younger brother is quite unique, dumb and they're great at the same time. I assume this is the beauty of wrestling, the pure nonsense, chaos and a little sense of humor mixed together. We have furious Kevin Owens who wants to find the evidence to show the world Ezekiel doesn't exist. And on the other hand we have Zeke himself who is making interactions with many wrestlers living by his character. Segment with Kane. <laughs> Glenn Jacobs was pretty lit. Glenn said to Ezekiel, he's better than Elias, who didn't say good things about Knoxville last time. Ezekiel said that he's a huge fan of the cane, and Glenn told him he's also the big fan of the cane. What a coincidence. Kayfabe is still alive. Miss Fury and returning Mustafa Ali, thanks God, it's not simply Ali. They also had the reference to our Zeke. Miss made a joke about Mustafa. He named him Mufasa, Ali's younger brother cause Ali was fired for some months ago. And this evening he made a huge comeback, challenging Fury for US Championship. By the way, that's the wonderful solution to make a comeback. Fire some jobber, wait 3-4 months and after this time make him great again. We can all agree, WWE is all about Ezekiel is master strategist. But most importantly, do not forget Ezekiel is running his social media in style of his character and simply that gives even more entertainment than ever. I don't know about you, but when I see something connected with the shenanigans created by this persona, I have a big smile on my face. In my opinion, nowadays the Ezekiel has the same influence like our truth when he was misunderstanding the stipulations with WWE pay-per-views such as Money in the Bank, Royal Rumble, Steel Cages, and etc. To conclude, I'm happy with Zeke's situation. WWE tends to change his gimmicks without hesitation and burying the past of some characters. In this case, we could say it's deeper than you think it is. That's what she said. Let me know what do you think about Zeke, the Elias younger brother. Kindly subscribe to Repertor Wrestling. See you in the near future. Deuces. Who wants to hear Zig speak?